student action. Okay, so we're gonna go over the close really quick on how to just get people. Austin just talked about how you set up an appointment, kind of the pitch in general. Uh, this is probably the most important portion of a pitch is the close. Um, a lot of people in sales, you hear the things always be closing, right? The ABCs, kind of the stuff like that. Guys, this is what's most important is making sure that when you are setting an appointment or you're talking with a homeowner, that you're getting them to this point. If you can uh, introduce yourself and go through the information of a pitch, but you can't close it, then you're never gonna be able to make money. Um, so the best way to do it is you always bring it down to two options. Um, if you give them any more than that, they always choose the, the worst option, right? So if you say, hey, do you want a sandwich? They're just gonna say no. Um, so you have to give them two options. Do you want white or wheat? Um, that's kind of how like Subway works. White or wheat? Uh, just very, very basic and simple. You kind of get two options. So the same thing with the customer. Um, so you get to the end of your pitch, um, talked about it, and you say, hey, we're actually going to have a consultant in the area today and tomorrow. Which of those two days works best for you? Um, and they'll pick. And in this scenario, they pick tomorrow. So great, right? So you're still not done. So they have an appointment tomorrow. What you have to do is break it down from there. So you have to say, okay, great. So tomorrow or afternoons or evenings better for you and your, you and your spouse. Um, evening, right? They're home later at night. I'm still not quite done at that point because all I have is tomorrow evening. So I have to ask them, six or eight? Cool, does six or six o'clock or eight o'clock work better for you guys? And they chose six o'clock. So by doing this, I process of elimination kind of when works best for them for an appointment. But a lot of it is psychological because they believe that they set this appointment. They weren't just told, hey, this is when the appointment is for. So they weren't able to kind of just cancel. What they do is they actually feel like in their mind is this is what they set up. Um, and so make sure that you always do it this way with the two steps. And so if they chose tomorrow afternoon, you kind of use two different times as well. Okay, perfect, two or four. And you kind of give them two options all the way up until they set the appointment. You get the information, the power bill, and call it into the office.